Hello Sagittarius, getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you. Okay, so I'm going to ask the universe for messages for Sagittarius. Marriage, intimacy, moving. Well, hello. Oh, we've got a whole plan here. Showing it. One more show, compassion. Okay. All right, some of you, there could be um, this one. Okay, some of you, there may be some unexpected changes for you, for, this, uh, for the person you're dealing with. This means, though, usually it's happening for you and someone else is going to miss you. But it could be the other way around. This may be predicting, let's, let's see what this is. You got, it is safe for you to love. Um, give your relationship a chance. And this one fell out, past life relationship. Okay. Under the deck, it does say retreat. And it does look like they're in a wedding dress, you know, in a tux or suit. So interesting card. So this sounds like somebody may be getting married. Obviously sleeping together and moving. So I don't know if it's in that order or if, if you know, that's interesting. And again, like I said, it may be, this usually means someone else is hurt to so see you move on. They don't want you, they were hoping that the two of you would get married or get back together or something because it's you, you just show them compassion. Even if it's like an ex or something you don't like. That's interesting. Okay. Let's see what is showing up for Sagittarius. Oops, I put this back. Oh, that was your card, huh? Page of Wands, communication. Okay. What do you need to know, Sagittarius, overall energy? Hermit. Could be a Virgo. Could be someone you haven't heard from. Uh, let's see. Your energy is a Ten of Cups, and their energy is the Four of Swords. Under the deck is a Three of Swords. Interesting. Could be um, a Pisces, an Earth sign, or an Air sign coming to you. Could be something that someone who has not moved on, someone who's still thinking about you, possibly. Could be someone brand new, though. This isn't resonating. We'll see what shows up, because... This kind of looks like someone who's thinking about you but is not communicating, but um, some of you may be married. Maybe some of you may be dealing with a third person or something. You are married and you're getting back together or you're moving. Let's see. What is the hermit energy? We have the nine of swords and the page of cups. Okay, I'm going to read it how I'm obviously seeing the cards. I can read it in different ways, but I can tell there's a specific story. and It may not resonate for a lot, but it's um, again, it could be foretelling the next six months. We have someone who wants to reach out to you who is kind of timid or worried maybe about reaching out to you. However it em ended, you guys may have gotten along very well, but then maybe you had to leave or they left. Maybe it was a long distance relationship or work relationship, something back here. Um, this person wants to reach out to you after they've been thinking about you for a while, but they are worried. They have to be strong in order to do it, you know, swallow their pride because you may say no, you may you know, tell them to go away, whatever. So again, they've been thinking, waiting, and now they're going to communicate. They're hoping for the best. Could be an Aquarius or a Leo. There you are. So you might be in another relationship possibly only because Ten of Cups is already on your side, but you have you and now you're looking at something differently. You're looking at something in a new way. Uh, something has come up and now all of a sudden it's kind of turned you maybe on your head. And it kind of seems like this might be something surprising. Someone, now it could be someone that you don't know, it doesn't look like it, but maybe it's a past life connection. And then when you see this person, it's like this strange feeling comes over you, all of a sudden just knowing like this is the person, this is the one. Um, maybe, you, you know, you want to get married. What is the Four of Swords? Eight of Coins and the Ace of Wands. Okay, Nine, nine of Wands and Ten of Wands. I kind of wanted to see, you might have met this person at work school, and remember, this could have been over the past year. This person has deep feelings for you, but they don't want to acknowledge them. This tells me that they think about you, but they try to ignore. They have not been able to let you go energetically. They keep thinking about you. It weighs on them. They need to take the chance and speak their mind, which is a good thing. You know what I mean? You might... It's possible you might turn this person down and they want you to show compassion. Maybe they want to get married. Maybe they want to be with you. They want to move, all that stuff, and you don't want to. You might have to show them compassion. I don't think that's going to happen. I mean, it could because I believe in speaking your mind. So this person is going to speak their mind. They don't care. Um, well, they do care. I was going to say they don't care what people think or what you think. They just, but it shows that they are timid, but they have to get it out, which is a good thing. Why wonder? Why wonder if the two of you were meant to be or how you feel about them? At least they're going to speak it, say it, 
maybe be embarrassed for a day or two possibly and then they'll move on they'll be it's good okay what is why is this going on what else we need to know about the situation for sagittarius ace of coin a big offer holding on to those coins thinking about you this is but this is marriage to me ace of coin is marriage and it, moving buying a home together possibly what is the ace of coin So walking away, we originally saw these cards under there. Walking away, being single, one more please. Nine of Cups of Wish Fulfilled. Five of Cups in Feeling Sad. Okay, so this could be an earth sign, someone you worked with, somebody with money who's been missing you. And again, there you are. Again, I'm assuming you know who this is, but again, past life relationship, maybe you don't. Maybe this is a sudden change for you. This is someone, again, who this is representing you walking away from your past. You're open, you're ready to receive someone new, being single, and then having a wish fulfilled. So, how do you feel or how will you feel about this person? Six of Cups. Again, past, past life. Okay, why? Also, that's a very sweet energy to me, Six of Cups. Excuse me, he's giving her flowers. What's the Six of Cups? Ten of Swords, Two of Swords, and the Nine of Wands. Interesting. So you must have a connection with this person, I would assume, with these coming out. Either that you've been kind of hurt and you're not really ready to take a chance on this person, or you're kind of like not quite there already, or you have some type of history with them you don't want to see, or you think maybe they're hurt. How do they feel about you? How do they feel about you? Okay, so they're wondering about you. Okay, this person may have up and left, and maybe this hurt you, because they're wondering about you, Seven of Cups, what you're doing, how you're feeling, how would things go, and maybe you're kind of like this person just maybe disappeared, possibly with Hermit, maybe they ghosted you, and so you're kind of, you were hurt by that. What is the Seven of Cups? Six of Swords, Four of Swords, and the Ten of Cups. This person is moving towards you very slowly, thinking about you. Now, you might be married because you have the Ten of Cups. You might already be in a relationship, or they might be, or they're just thinking about being Ten of Cups with you, because that is marriage to me, and then moving would probably be a house, and maybe for some of you, there might be children or having kids involved or anything like that. But they're definitely wondering about how you're thinking, how you're feeling, what you're doing. So this is definitely a reconciliation in some way, either a past life person or a person in this lifetime who's coming back around. So I'm gonna also clarify, show compassion before Okay, Ace of Wands fell out in my lap. I'm going to do potential outcome, potential outcome. So Nine of Coins. So I'm going to take this and this. Knight of Coins under the deck. What does this mean? Okay, so it could be Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, obviously. Could be an earth sign, could be communication. This person is going to be very straightforward. I get, if, I get they may be a Gemini, but again... This might be a past person. Hang on. Okay, the person who's coming back in, there's definitely opportunity here with Nine of Coins and Ace of Wands. The timing's right. I feel like you're open and ready. They see you as a good catch. I think you feel the same way about them. There's passion here still. Um, what is the show compassion card for Sagittarius? The universe has a plan. And one more, please. Hurt. Okay, so someone is hurt. So yeah. Whoever the person is hurt, and I feel like it's the other person. Let me do one more. I'm getting, okay, distance. World travel and distance. So being, this person may have had a job that took him away, possibly. Or you guys can be at a distance right now. So I get two things here. Actually, this person is going to be very forward, I get. They're going to be very blunt and to the point. King of Swords, Ace of Swords. And it could be kind of even financial in nature when they communicate or something that's not very romantic. This is not a lot of whole, not a lot of romance right now and passion. I feel like they're going to come in, they're going to speak their mind, they're going to say how they feel about you, what they want, and do you want this with them? This person already has a plan. They want to marry you. They want to be with you. They want to move. They want to, you know, travel. They definitely have strong feelings for you. They definitely have their eye on you. So again, you might, you might turn them down. I'm just going to read it that way because I can see it. And you might, they might want you to show compassion and be like, you know what, I just don't want that. However, 
I do feel like there may be someone else in the picture who is also interested in you. You might already be married to someone or in a relationship with someone or an ex who wants to be with you, not this person. So that may be the person who is going to be hurt by this, but you may have to show them compassion. So take it as it resonates, but I mean, it's very obvious that there's somebody who has very strong feelings for you and wants to be with you. You might work with this person right now. They might work in a different country, not just city, maybe different city or country, but they definitely might be at a distance from you. Um, for some of you, you've known this person for a year and you do know that this person has these strong feelings for you. See what else am I picking up? I kind of felt like for somebody, maybe you do confide in this person about past or recent breakup that you've been going through this person. So this person knows a lot about your personal life also, and they have strong feelings for you and they want to tell you how they feel. So again, that might play in where, to, where you don't necessarily have feelings for this person. And um, what else do we need to know about this person? We have attraction, so that means they're very attracted to you, but that's kind of obvious from this reading. I mean, they have like the wedding plan, the china picked out. Retreat, that was under the deck, retreat. So I think you need to spend some time with this person and free yourself. And there's a soulmate here. I get that whatever is holding you back for some, if it is an ex, anything that, get out of it and explore this opportunity with this new person. Spend some time with this person. I feel like, I feel like they will treat you very well, Sagittarius. I feel like they're very, um, get the word like doting. Like when you guys are alone, maybe in public or around other people, they, they are not. Maybe they do not like PDA. Um, I get when you're alone with them, a different side of them opens up. They show a very a, a attractive side to them, very something where they're very attracted to you. They're very sweet to you, um, spending time with you alone. All right, what else do we need to know about this person for Sagittarius? What else? Because I oh yeah, got my sleep there. Passionate, yes. Very passionate, but I think very specifically with you and only you. Like they reserve all that type of energy for you. This, again, this could be an ex who still wants to get back together with you and it's not this new person. But if this new person is coming across this way, I do get like they reserve that passion, that love, that affection for you and only you. They are not out there flirting with everyone. They are very extremely caring when it comes to you. They do things for you that, that um, you know, not to be sexist, but it's like things like you may not want to take your car in and to get it fixed, but you do it anyways. But they may do those little things that you don't want to do for you to show you that they care. And they want to make sure that you feel, you know, cherished, taken care of, you know, um, different things like that. It's kind of how I feel like this person, like they treat you like they, you are their lady or their, your man, however it works. So it, it's, and it's, again, it's only, it's reserved for you and only you, which is very special. What else? So they have passionate here and very sincere. Yeah. There's a very like laser focus on this person when it comes to you. And I can feel it and it's, 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 I can see it. It's hard to articulate it, but I can see what they're doing. And it's very like personable when it comes to you. Very, um, I'll just leave that there. Anything else about this person we need to know, good or bad, good or bad. They may have lost a spouse. And again, that could be through death or divorce or um, a split. So, and also it says dark hair and eyes under the deck. So, I'm gonna do just another line because I feel like this is very open-ended. I feel like for the majority of you, this person, you're gonna take a chance on this person and get to know them. Three of coins, Knight of cups. For a few of you, you may know who this is. For someone, they may be 10 or 20 years older than you and you do work with this person and you do know that they are very much interested in you. They're either a coworker or they could be your boss, but I feel like you work very closely with this person. Like this person would be a very good partner and mate for you. Um, what else? Let's pick up just now. Um, this is something, again, they need to get off their chest. They wake up with it every morning and go to sleep thinking about it. So this might actually be them. 
they may need to free themselves and they may need to tell you how they feel so again if you're not interested in them show them compassion because they really are coming from a very deep sincere place for their feelings for you what else do we need to know about this person or situation please and thank you oh, there you are oh my gosh new cycle starting with this person three of cups i get celebration i don't get third party there's nothing here but well you might but let me see they might wonder about they might wonder if you're dating someone or with someone for yourself you might be yeah i am or wants a new beginning could be twin flame now look at this though you're here and they they're here and they match your energy perfectly but look at how they're looking over at you right i'm assuming this is them could be the other way around but um actually she's looking over at him too not quite at him but he's just full-on staring at her so what is lizards looking cats not looking of course very aloof but anyways so thinking about you wanting to be with you now a new cycle is beginning with the world so again there could be a third person possibly involved i don't think it's a big deal because i have a feeling that person's going to be shoved out of the picture to be honest um it could be a leo we have gemini but again wondering how you're feeling wondering about if you're dating someone else wondering what's going on but this person does love you and they want to start this new cycle with you the four of wands i think they think about you a lot with seven of swords and the five of swords there might be a water sign involved maybe they are a water sign excuse me watcher sign but again, very emotional if they're not. They might be with someone else because look at how he's looking there. I'm mean, looking back over it, like wanting to build something new. But I'm not going to go too far back in there because I can see maybe, maybe they're dating someone else, but that's not who they love. Who they love is you. All right, Sagittarius. So I'm going to leave it here. I hope this is helpful. Have a really good week, you guys, and I'll talk to you soon.